Now let's talk about how to find the missing operation in a multiplication and division problem. Here we want to know what sign would fill in this blank. Will it be a multiplication sign or a division sign? Let's look at our problem. Here we have 31 times 3, some operation 4, divided by 2 equals 186. Knowing from our order of operations that we're going to start from the left and move to the right, and seeing that we have one operation before our blank, we can start by filling in that operation and simplifying from here. So if we have 31 times 3, that's going to equal 93. So now we have 93, some operation 4, divided by 2 is going to equal 186. Now if we're working backwards to fill in a blank and we know that the last operation we're going to do is dividing by 2 because whatever goes in this blank is going to be the next thing we'll do. We can work backwards here by actually multiplying both sides of our equation by 2. Since this is our last step if we work backwards it'll be our first step. So if we multiply by 2 That'll cancel out these twos, and 186 times 2 is 372. Now we have 93, sum operation 4, equals 372. Do we want to multiply or divide? Well, if we divide 93 by 4, our number will be much too small to be 372. So we actually want to multiply here. We have 93 times 4 will equal 372. This is true, so the sign we're going to fill in here is multiplication.